And I'm awake. Let's go, fake rooster. Strawberries. That's a giant strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> so does our honey just kind of make itself? Yep, it just takes X number of days to create. Alright then. What's this new smelter thing by the front of my house? It creates gems. And so you put a oh. gem in it and it will create more gems. So I put a diamond in it, and it will start making diamonds. Alright then. And it's a little mini kale harvest. Perfect, I keep watering the wrong direction. another sprinkler to water this stuff up here? You could make another sprinkler. Pretty sure it's a uh, iron bar, gold bar, and a... Mm -hmm. something other bar. Refined quartz. I am tending to the livestock. <laughs> as I do every day. You standing just... outside of Pierre's door like a creeper. Hi, Ferda. Flower dance is coming up on Wednesday. Oh, good. What's that? It's the day where we go dance with flowers. With flowers? About flowers? For flowers? I don't... It's like yes. the Tournament of Roses parade, or what? I don't know why roses need a tournament, but probably. Right? It's one thing humans are good at, it's wasting natural resources. Yay! Everybody loves me. Oh, I got a truffle! Yeah, good pig. Yeah, apparently we need to buy more pigs. Right? We can go buy another pig. We have plenty of money, don't we? We do. Even after spending all that money, we still have 25,000 sitting around. <laughs> right? <laughs> <sighs> Hi, guys. Apparently the sheep did not want to go outside. What do you mean? The sheep is out in the pen. Well, who is still inside? One of the goats came well, in. The goats didn't want to go outside. What are you making over there? Uh, kale. <gasps> Holy Moses! Marnie's actually there! What kind of nonsense is that? Right? Oh, how much cloth do we have? I don't know, like five or six? Because five is enough for a mill. Okay, what are we naming the pig? Billy? Many? Yepo? Shabo? Zupibo? Henley? Trog? Cricardo? Kek? Kekar? Yeah, Kekardo. Nickover, Baki, nope. Predabelt, nope. Rose, Certino, Rosert, Sitsino, oh, I don't know what that means. Romo, New, Lopert, Snella, Goka, Lana. Ugh. Petchu. Okay. I like that. <laughs> Pet you. It's 
kind of punny. Gesundheit. Mm -hmm. So I bought another pig. Do we need anything else from Marnie before she runs away? I don't think so. That pig was expensive. <laughs> yeah, pigs are expensive. Foraging. Hopefully you have enough for a mill, otherwise I'm supposed to look at the skid tomorrow. weird. Oh, the salmon berry must have just been hanging out. <laughs> Construct farm building. Mill. Yes. <gasps> A squirrel just ran up in that tree. Jason said squirrel and the girls both ran to the window because they're good dogs <laughs> and he's a mean owner I'm gonna put the mill in the top right corner behind the box so what does the mill give us flour oh right on things like rice So we can make gluten-free flour Correct. from the rice. If you're into that sort of thing. I'm not. <laughs> Thank God. Bad enough, I can't eat dairy. I don't want to have to avoid gluten, too. Well, it's a good thing you found that leak when you dig. I can't find anything. I found a couple more. Hmm. Anywho's it. So those are all big plans today, and of course, celebrating, <sighs> celebrating democracy today. I think I have discussed enough my political views on our stream that talking about it today is not out of turn, and that democracy has prevailed And we chose to dump the turd on November 3rd. Yes, I said it. If you've tuned in at all <laughs> to our stream or watched it on YouTube, you know very well neither one of us are fans of the current president. He is by far the most corrupt president our nation has ever had. And it, like his corruption is just so blatant. That's what's disturbing about it. Don't forget he's also, isn't he the first incumbent president to run impeached? Yeah. So uh, that didn't happen that long ago, folks. He was just impeached the beginning of this year. I know that seems like forever ago because so much has happened in 2020, but he was impeached. The Senate Republicans just decided not to remove him from office, which, well, like was Clinton. around, huh? Like Bill Clinton. Yeah. So Bill Clinton was impeached. The Senate Democrats just chose not to remove him from office. 
Although, unlike Bill Clinton, <laughs> Trump wasn't at the end of his presidency when that happened. Trump was at the beginning of his presidency when that happened. Well, actually, it was two years in when he... It was about two and a half years in when that process started. Yeah. Because he's a con man and a crook. And you can fight me on that and argue with me. But the facts are, are in. He's terrible. And I'm disgusted that this election was as close as it was. It should have been a complete landslide. Like, after all the crap that he's pulled, you still are going to vote for him because he's anti-abortion and pro-gun? Didn't he himself say that he wanted to do away with due process and just take guns away from people? He did. He did In say that. On Fox News? Yeah. It's funny. <laughs> There's a whole subreddit called Trump criticizes Trump and it's Trump tweeting the opposite of what he tweets now. And it's like, oh, I just, why are you such a hypocrite, man? And the entire Republican Party is just hypocrites. When it's, it's not even like now, like it's it's tweets from like a year ago. Right. Predicting what he says now or vice versa. Right. Because he, there's this eight-year-old tweet that he tweeted out after President Obama won uh, election that something about the Electoral College is the worst thing to happen to democracy. <laughs> because he had thought Obama had just won the Electoral College and not the popular vote. When in fact, President Obama had won both the Electoral College and the popular vote. In fact... It seems that only Republicans are the ones that get elected not winning the popular vote. I mean, and I, I, I will say this, Trump is not wrong. The Electoral College is bad for democracy. Because Wyoming and its population should not have the same voting power as California. Or New York. What is it? Something like 10% of the United States' population lives in New York City? Yeah. Yeah. 10%. 10% of the population in the United States lives in New York City. Give or take. Like. I just, I can't, I can't, I, I, like if you made a conscious decision to vote for that criminal, I, I can't, I will not. You see your dog. Which one? <laughs> Chewing bones is, takes a lot of energy. You okay over there? All right. Cute dog. Yeah. She's over there laying on her side. You didn't sell any of those truffle but, but, Okay, leave it. I forgot to, sorry. But now there's like this bone in like 10 pieces that I need to pick up so somebody doesn't eat it. It's on your face, dog. Gross. Slobber? Something. You can, you can chew on that as a bowel if you want. This is the most broken up a bone has, has ever been. Like, you can't really see these little pieces. It usually doesn't break up like that. She usually is able just to eat it. But they say, like on the package, that I can take like these broken up pieces and put them in the microwave. But it never works out that way. They always turn into like hard hockey pucks. So I just I just throw them out because I don't want like this like I don't want her to like eat that because she could just swallow that thing whole and it could stab her because she's that dog. What are you doing? Uh, sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about you didn't me. Even comment on the fact that we made eighteen thousand bucks that today last night. Oh. 
We did? What did yeah. what did what did we sell? Between the strawberries and the um stuff that you made. Did I I thought I made oh, oh the artisan stuff? Yeah. Notice Pierre here, I really, really want a plate of sashimi. I'll pay top coin to whoever brings me some. So I have to make sushi? We can make we can make maki. We don't have I don't have the recipe for sashimi. Oh. Oh, Queen of Sauce is on. Maybe she'll teach us. I I was just looking at that, but no. Today's recipe was complete breakfast. Oh, we had a complete breakfast this morning. I'm oh, sorry, we had brunch. So complete breakfast. You have to make three dishes and have milk. Oh. <laughs> so it's one fried egg, one hash browns, one pancake, and milk. It's a complete breakfast. Oh. I guess I'm harvesting this kale. Harvest time. And some green beans. And this one thing of kale. That's funny. And this potato. Okay, I watered the stuff. Now I will go tend to our livestock. So all the major news outlets, the Associated Press, have announced that Joe Biden has won enough electoral votes to, I'll just water the chickens apparently, to, um, to win. He has 290 electoral votes. Because he won Pennsylvania and Nevada. But of course, the dumpster fire in the White House currently is not accepting that. So, should be an interesting couple of months. It can't be any more interesting than the last couple of years. So. Right. <laughs> Pigs are good. Oh, look at the little, little, little piggy. And I have two truffles. Hi, Pernard. Hi, Gertie. I just want to pick up this truffle. Can I pet everybody? Poor Mary. Yep. Pet you. <laughs> uh. Pet you is my baby pig. Hey, Tess, how you doing? Collect my milks. Everybody's fed. What's going on with you and the missus? I saw there was a fire of some sort. I'm hoping everyone was okay and no one was hurt. I will make my artisan goods. Super exciting. Maybe. I'm going to go put some of this stuff in the thing. Yep, you had a house fire in September. Oh, that's great. I'm glad everyone is okay. It still sucks, but I'm glad everyone is okay. Fire is devastating.
Okay, eggs. Did you sneeze? Did I sneeze? Yeah. No. Did one of the dogs sneeze? No. She was chewing on her bone. Oh, maybe it's time to not be chewing on a bone. <laughs> okay, I got my artisan goods going. Oh, we have two oil machines, so I can make two truffles. And make some more... Oh, wait. I was picking up truffle oil. Okay. What was that? What'd you what sell? That, that I had a a, a dingling. What? Like a noise. Like a chime. I have no idea. Oh. Is that a I Facebook did, thing? I did nothing. Anyway, Pierre's notice. Pierre will pay top... Oh, wait, I thought we already did this. Or at least accepted it. Oh, this is where you're putting the mill up here, where Robin is fast at work. Oh, it was a... Oh, because I have the sound on the stream turned off. My guess is it... Uh, yeah. All of which you can see, dear, on your other monitor. What other monitor? <laughs> oh, you shared the stream. Oh, thanks, Tess. <laughs> well, I got just distracted. <laughs> Snickle Fritz. <laughs> Thank you, Tess. Uh, shoot, it's a magical day here. Every day is magical with me. Right, Pratt? Yes. Mm -hmm. It mm -hmm. has been for six years. We have been together for ten. I stand by. <gasps> <laughs> mm -hmm. Ten years. We've been together for a decade. We met in 2008. We started dating in 2010. It is now 2020. And all of these things are true. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <sighs> mm -hmm. Right? Yeah, it's great. It's what a decade looks like, Tess. So I think I was uh, telling everyone earlier that I did ask Diva to marry me. Diva, do you recall our uh, my proposal? I do. What were we doing? We were walking back from either back or to the cemetery in Wyoming, which is where we were living at the time. <clears throat> the cemetery is usually where we walked because it was a nice place to walk the dogs. Uh, and you sort of sheepishly started talking to me about how you thought that we were good together and that what if maybe we got married or something and it was incredibly cute <laughs> you're welcome <laughs> he said yes by the way of course I, I did say yes and then we were engaged for a year <laughs> to be fair, Tess, 2020 has been uh, right. <laughs> interesting to begin with. It has fruit been... trees don't produce fruit until summer anyway? That's weird. I don't know. Are you looking at the fruit trees? They're up there. Yeah. Beside the other side of the cave. What is Oppa looking at? He's like just staring up the lane. Yeah, they're here and these two guys? Maybe this third one? Well, because the other one's full grown. It just hasn't produced any fruit yet. Yeah, these aren't full grown over here. Do you need to plant hay? I did already. Oh, is this what the hay over here? Ooh, there's some. Yeah. <gasps> Excuse me. That's 
750. I've done all the things. So we're down to we're down to 161 pieces of hay. No. Yeah. 2020 <laughs> has been a year, girl. Factually correct. It has been a year. And it's not even over. Nope. At it's all. A lot, it's a lot closer to being over than I thought we'd make it to. to be right? <laughs> I mean, we're already, this, what, peaking this out? The, this has been the fastest and the slowest year ever. Right. Like, it feels like it's been going on forever, but it also feels like yesterday was March. Right. <laughs> Can I put that in there? Yeah. Why am I putting cloth in there? Did you move the cloth? I did move the cloth. Okay. Because the, the other one was getting full. Oh, okay. What do we need clay for? You have a theory? What's your theory, Tess? The clay is mostly used for buildings. Oh, I don't right know how on. much more of it will actually need. Okay. Everything is in... in to be... Um, sold. Or maybe our fruit tree will give fruit in the summer? That's what I was thinking. Are you going to bed? Uh, I guess. What do we need to make? He wants sushi or sashimi? He wants sashimi. Glazed yams, hash browns. Because we have, we have the recipe for maki rolls, but we don't have sashimi. Oh, a maki roll. So we have to learn the recipe for that. Yeah. I'm going to go buy Gus's place tomorrow and see. Can we buy the recipe. recipe for that? Yeah. yeah. I mean, most of the recipes you can buy. Oh, bad timeline. Yeah, Friday the 13th and Halloween. And Oh, that's fair. I mean, we're coming up on Friday the 13th, next Friday. It's like a weird version of the Langoliers. Oh. What did we make? Whoa. A lot of money. Look at all that. Because you sold. <laughs> hey, like Francis. Crap ton of things. On my Plus artisan three truffle oils, Three. Jesus. So much money. The goat cheese makes a lot of The duck mayonnaise. Nice. We did okay today, honey. It was a good day. <laughs> Sorry, Fred. The teeth stuff was a full moon. It's all good. It has not rained. Not a, in not like in, two not weeks. this game. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, wait, I wanted to see about the cooking show. I just have to check the cooking show. But you said we can also... Oh, there's living off the land. You said we can buy the recipe, right? Yeah, I think Gus sells it sometimes. What's our weapon it? special attack? Swords can block, which is very useful when your slimes are jumping. And clubs can pound the ground, sending enemies flying. Like if you equip your sword and you right click, that's what it's talking about. Oh, right on. I didn't realize that other weapons had like other things they could do. You didn't? Because I only ever use a sword. I've never used another weapon. Oh, right on. Gotta pet all the animals. for a pino. Does everybody love me? I guess so. <laughs> Did I love all of the animals? Got up my eggs. Everybody's fed. Oh god, Gus doesn't even open until like 2pm. So. What are you going to Gus for? I was going to see if he sold those recipes. Oh, yeah. right on. Doesn't even open until noon. <gasps> that must be nice. Right. Oh, excuse me. There's a yawn. 
Hitting up the pigs. Oh, no truffles today. Oh, I watered the sheep, so there's that. That's like the smell of wet wool. Oh, I'm gonna chop down these trees that are starting to grow in the pen. That's fine. Okay, there's an axe. I just don't want any trees to grow in their pen. Well, I've been trying to clear out around the the farm because some of those trees are just getting a little dense. <laughs> Someone doesn't plant their trees in rows. Ooh, what, what, that that's not how it works. Why are we planting them in rows? So it's neater. So it's. Is this what you've done down here? Planted them in rows? I followed your lead. Did you? No. Mm -hmm. Let's see about that. I'll make my artisan goods. Some of this is just tedious. Moving stuff places. I'm gonna need to go OUT. Well, she has 15 minutes. Hi, sweet dog. So we had a complete breakfast. Oh, we had brunch today. We make brunch every Saturday. And by we, I mean I make brunch every Saturday. <laughs> today we had oh, kiwi. greasy trucks, truck stop breakfast. So I made bacon and chicken sausage, which is delicious. I, like, I didn't make the bacon, like I, I bought bacon and I made it in the oven. And then um, hash browns, and I totally cheated on those, I just bought them frozen. You know, like you do. And eggs, and toast, just delicious. So usually we would eat over at the truck stop breakfast. You would always get fried steak? Yeah, chicken fried steak. Excuse me, chicken fried steak and gravy and he would get hash browns and two eggs, right? Yep. And I would just get um, eggs, bacon, hash browns, and toast. It's delicious. Hot sauce on that. It's a good breakfast. But then, because we eat brunch, we usually don't eat any lunch. And then we'll have our fancy dinner for tonight so it'll be a double celebration our anniversary and me figuring out how to sense. there was I was like trying to <laughs> harvest the mayonnaise <laughs> we'll be celebrating our anniversary and Joe Biden and Kamala Harris Saving democracy. And, ladies, the first woman vice president in our nation's history. Which is just beyond amazing. Like, amazing. And it's just, it's phenomenal. It's just a phenomenal day in history having a, a woman vice president it is beyond time for that to happen i mean plenty of tv shows have made it happen <laughs> the fact that we as did i already pet appa today i must have already petted what is this thing over here it's the windmill what does it look like not that this thing by the dingleberries the dog the dog is up there. This thing here. Oh, it makes uh, coal out of wood. Oh. 
This game is weird. So we just, what do we put in the mill? Grain. Did we plant any grain? I have rice. Do we need to plant more grain? I mean, I can plant wheat in the summer. Is that when we plant wheat? Doesn't wheat turn into hay, though? Wheat also turns into hay, yes. It also turns into wheat. <laughs> oh, it just depends on when you pick it, or what? No, it produces both. Oh, what? I'm confused. So when you harvest wheat, you get wheat and hay. Like in the real world. <laughs> You, you know that's where hay comes from, right? <laughs> Hello. I don't know. Didn't your family, like, own a farm? It's true, they did. <laughs> Just because they owned a farm doesn't mean I know how to farm. I mean, I could plant a garden and keep it alive. Do we have any mushrooms? Yeah, we have mushrooms. Put all of the rice into the flower maker. <laughs> is that what you're calling it now? The flower maker? That's what it is. Yeah, but it's sure. Makes flower. You're my hero. Oh, now we come to the part of our stream where I just yawn all the time. Because it for came much later than normal. I know it's usually like about like twelve thirty. I start yawning, and it's, it's it, in my defense, I have been up since five thirty, and I would like to know why, but I just am. Yay! I sold mushrooms. There's truffle oil and mayonnaise in this box that you could sell if you wanted to. Okay. Uh, that one. How about this one? There's a truffle in the yard. There are two truffles in the yard. Oh, how are there truffles in the yard? Did you pet the cows today? I feel like I pet the cows today. Did I not? Yeah, I did, because there weren't any truffles when I went in. Oh, that's good. I'm so glad I do that. Okay, oh yeah, because I got the eggs and I petted all the chickens and rabbits. Did you pick up the truffles? No, not yet. Ah. Uh. Those were not there earlier. I wonder if I should make a little... Should I make a little stone path to the... Sure. The barns? That would be easier. Do we have a recipe for that? Yeah, it's just stick stone. <laughs> Pretty sure we have a thing for stone path. Yeah, cobblestone path. But yeah, so I've been up since five five thirty, and apparently I've decided to rewatch How I Met Your Mother. Mother. What? Oh, fun. Did you make enough? I mean, we have a lot. Uh, what? What's the recipe to make it? Stone. Oh, right on. Okay, I should sell our artisan goods.
and make some truffle oil before it's time to go to bed. I definitely, I like the visual and the noise because it makes kind of like a bubble noise. Doesn't take much to, you know, impress me. I mean, yeah. Well, that's fun, a little cobblestone. Now it should make it so that trees won't grow there. Oh, fun. Thanks, honey. Nice work. I'm going to go to bed. What? I said I do what I can. I know. More living off the land. Here's a tip for you ventures out there. Oh, I already li did I already listen to this? I did. I totally did. It's getting late. I should go to bed. I think we have one more day. Yeah. One day more. I mean, we don't... Oh, we still have another two and a half months of this presidency, though. That's not good, is it? That's fine. What, two and a half months of this presidency <clears throat> is fine? It'll be fine. We just can't do anything meaningful because he can't get anything through the house. Oh, that's right. He can do some executive actions, but then those can be undone immediately. Holy crap. What? Emily showed up at the door. Uh, why is she so creepy? Dear Pepper, you're such a good neighbor. I thought I'd send over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up, Marnie. Um, thanks, Marnie. That was weird. Dear Pepper, tomorrow we're getting together for the flower dance. Woo! The flower dance. If you can find a partner, you might even want to participate in the dance yourself. There's a little clearing beyond the forest west of the town where we hold the dance. Arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. if you're interested. Mayor Lewis. Do I just put this hay in the... Where do I put this hay? Oh, I thought the, the hay goes into the uh, hay buckets. <laughs> the hay buckets? Is that... that Inside talking? the... Uh, the barn or the chicken coop. Right on. Alright, so unmilled rice turned into rice. Apparently. Didn't you say the the rabbit gives us rabbit feet? The rabbit will eventually give us rabbit feet. Yes. That's weird. You're weird. I am, but that's weird. <laughs> I'm allowed to think that's weird. Got to figure out something else to plant in place of the kale. We can't plant kale anymore? Because kale takes six days and there are only five right on. days remaining this season. So it's either turnips or garlic or... Okay, what the other one is. We did not make a lot on garlic, did we? No, but it, I mean it's about the same as parsnips. So. Okay, so I'm petting everybody in the b other barn, the cows and the pigs and the goats, the sheep, and there are no truffles. Noted. But I have lots of eggs and milk, so I will make those things. Everyone's been petted and is happy. Should we get another sheep? Uh, 
that I, you don't know, or...? I mean, I don't think so, but... No. Rice takes eight days, holy cow. Make some goat's milk, cheese, because that makes us a lot of money. Harvest the truffle oil. Well, garlic it is, I guess. It's either garlics or parsnip, and garlics sell better than parsnips. Oh yeah? That's weird. Well, because parsnips are cheaper. Oh, right on. everything together. This will probably be our last day on our stream today. So what did you plant? Garlic. Right on. Oh, kill me. Oh, yep. You know, it becomes the yawning portion of the stream. Super exciting, I know. Maybe we need a path through this side of the forest in our property. So I can get down this way. Oh, fart. Oh, there's a bunny. It jumped in that bush over there. Well, that was a terrible cast. I'm not so good at the fishing. At all. Oh, my forking, uh... Maybe, maybe, no! I disagree! Hole for holes. This is dumb. Fishing is dumb! <laughs> Could have caught that fish. Stupid fish. <sighs> did you buy a new fishing pole, you said? I did. Why? Because it allows you to use tackle. Oh, bait. <laughs> no, bait and tackle. Oh. Why didn't that do anything? I click it fast enough. Oh, broken glasses. Hello, neighbor. Hi, hi, Leah. Leah. We both live outside of town. Does that mean something? Does it? What? What is she doing? Well, I can't fish that way. I can't fish that way. I suck at fishing anyway. I don't know why I fish. <laughs> Is this 
so stupid. Like, there's no middle ground. Like, it's either... I can... <laughs> it's stupid. I can't explain it. Either I click the mouse button too slowly or too fast or... Oh good, I got a broken CD. I do appreciate that the recycle machine lets you kind of upcycle these things into something useful, but... still weird. Oh. I will say, like, I put in a new CD uh, to listen to on my way to work yesterday morning, and uh, my friend is just, like, a master of music, and he is really great at making mixed CDs and stuff like that. Just fantastic music. And I hadn't listened to this one in quite some time. And I put it in. And I, ac I, I accidentally put in the second CD. So there are two CDs in this. He made a um, little gift when we were moving from Wyoming to Florida. Because I had to drive by myself from Wyoming to Ohio. And then from Ohio down to Florida. And... Uh, so I made me this two disc CDs and the second I put in the second disc and the first song was uh, Steely Dan's Changing of the Guard. And I thought, what an appropriate song for this time in our nation's history. It was great. Then I listened to it again on my way home. Oh, I'm not fishing. I'll make some more cheese. Put these things in the recycle. Wonder what glasses make. Uh, quartz, I believe. Oh, cool. Oh, I thought I had another egg. Hmm. Why don't you finish the path and put the up to the thingy? Up to the thingy. To the box where we sell things. Oh, I can do that. Will you go with me to the flower dance tomorrow? <laughs> I suppose. That'll be the first thing in our stream next Saturday is flower dance. Refined quartz. Yes. I turned the broken CD and the glasses into refined quartz. Wasn't there a gem or something I'm supposed to give to somebody? Did you ever give that uh, amethyst to someone? Pierre's notice. No, Pierre wants a fresh fruit stew. Pam is thirsty. Maybe? Emily needs an apricot. Gus needs an albacore. Find the shadowy figure. Did we find the shadowy figure? Did I Did I not do that? We did not do that. Crop research. Bring Dimitri back to... We need a melon. We, now we need two melons, don't we? We've had that quest for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, kids. Well, this is going to wrap up... Um, spring well not all of spring but this will wrap up um our streaming for today i hope everyone has a great saturday it looks like it's really nice out maybe go outside and enjoy some of the outdoors before the evil of winter um grips you in its icy fingers yes and it's really cold. Anyway, 
Uh, but whilst you do that, please remember that we're still very much in the throes of a pandemic. So please wash your hands, wear a mask, social distance, and stay home when you can. Stay home when you can. Wear a mask. Wash your hands for 20 seconds. And that's not one, two, and then you're done, which I have witnessed people doing, and it's depressing and sad. So I usually uh, say the alphabet and the Greek alphabet a couple of times. I, I, I do remember the Greek alphabet. That's weird, I know. Um, or you can sing the theme song to the Golden Girls in your head, which I've done as well. Yes, it's fun. Makes the day a little more interesting. Anyway, but yeah, wear a mask, wash your hands, social distance, stay home. These are four simple, easy things you can do to help stop the spread of COVID-19, which happens to be a respiratory disease. So you have to wear your mask over your nose and your mouth. Both things are connected to your lungs. Respiratory area. Your respiratory area. <laughs> Just in case you didn't know that your nose was part of your respiratory system. As some people I've seen out and about wearing their mask under their nose. Like, it doesn't work that way, folks. Sorry to burst your bubble. And thank you to everyone who did everything they could to help raise awareness register voters, campaign for liberal and Democrats alike, because sometimes they're not all very liberal anyway. Maybe. I don't know. For campaigning for those individuals and doing all you can to raise awareness and educate people. Educate people. Step out of your comfort zone now and then. But um, it's great. It is a great day for democracy. And we will not be run, overrun by uh, the fascist that um, has laid its evil seeds in our great nation. Right? Are you there, Pratt? Yes. Are you, do, do you agree with, with that? Sure. We mean sure. <laughs> anyway, thanks for tuning in. It's nice uh, to chat with Tess and Francis. Tune back in. We're here every Saturday, noon to two. We'll keep streaming on Facebook to see if that changes up our viewership. Uh, you can always uh, catch our rewind videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays when they drop on YouTube. You can always go back and watch me play other video games, Sans Diva. And you can, we still have uh, our tournaments up from when we had our business and we had Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Tournaments. So all that material is still on our YouTube channel, which is now called The Taculars. Always tune in to our social medias to see what's up. We're on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So you can catch us there. Someday we'll actually have a website, maybe. <laughs> when I get around to it. Hi, sweet dog. But until then, I hope you guys have a fantastic week. We'll catch you next Saturday. Thank you. Nope. I forgot. We changed that. We just have to do it manually. <laughs>